All right, YouTube 116 Falconer here. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Today I'm doing a video <coughs> on uh, this uh, nine-inch Craftsman Edger, old-timey Edger. Um, I had a uh, person who asked me if I could do a video on the carburetor linkage. So you know, I'm fitting it into my schedule because you know, I mean, I get literally tens of views per video. And I mean, I get like, you know, sometimes I get like two comments per video, so it's really hard for me to keep up with the demand. So, I figured I'd, you know, work it into my schedule here. So anyways, here is the linkage for this Craftsman 9-inch edger. I think it would probably be best to go to an old you know boneyard or something find an old Tecumseh motor and uh, and pull the linkage off because I think it'd be the same whether it's whether it's uh, a side shaft or bottom shaft you know just a, a regular Tecumseh lawnmower engine I think it'd be pretty much pretty much the same but I don't know um, so here it is, we have the throttle, All right, which operates the spring, which goes up, operates your governor control back in there. Now this, now I'm not sure which piece he's referring to, but this this, uh, where the hell is my freaking finger? This right here, there are three slots up top here, and this is in the one furthest towards the front of the engine here. Um, and of course, you have your your uh, your choke. Get a look at the bottom here. That's off the throttle again. Spring goes over. Over to the whatever you call this thing here. And it's a pretty simple setup. So um, and I'm not really sure what particular part or piece of linkage he's looking for but or whatever so, so that's it you got your throttle your choke your governor and the spring at the bottom there so if you have uh, if that's not what you're looking for let me know all right, see ya, bitches.